Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. This is your wizard in a blizzard, your electric scimitar, mystical machine gun. Walking you back for the last time. To a hat in time. 86% complete. We've got our little friend. Little seal friend there. We won't be seeing the seals today. Represent him in chat. Represent him with the new sound alerts. That one's going to get me in trouble. And I had to put my own spin in as well. <laughs> All right, let's do this. We are, we've got a, we've got a simple goal today. We're going to get the last couple of time pieces. We'll finish off the Alpine area. And then it's on to Fantasy Star Zero. Why am I starting Fantasy Star Zero before win back? One, because it's my stream and I can do whatever I want. Two, because Fantasy Star Zero is going to take way longer than win back will so I can't believe it not only is there only like two fantasy star games to go after all this time but it's not a fantasy star universe game oh my lord would you believe okay first things first there's a couple of time rifts and battle of the birds I have not done One, I'm pretty sure one's on Murder on the Al Express. Which is my favourite, absolute favourite area in this whole, whole game anyway. Why, hello there, as you can, from one owl to another. We can share detail. Oh. We, won't, we won't be hanging fellow, around here. Fellow ex you should not. I can help your daily life become more secure. What I see, I see. Did you notice that there's suddenly a lot of crows on this train? They all gone on at the last stop. Speaking of, Edwin, what do you mean you fell from the sky? That's what we do. Did you know that did you also un for but if you had a pet, what do you think the name of your pet's It resists speedrunning. Is Okay, so Pass the capture. Fellow Express Owl, the most important fee if you were a superhero. What is our intricate superhero your name? name be? If entered on that name is great. I'll just write your answer. Yeah, where is that? Is it there? Oh, it's here. <laughs> Easy. Hardest part is getting past all the crows. The Owl Express. Ah, oh, good old classic time riff. None of this deep sea bullshit. And the music is relaxing. This is where I want to be. Okay, maybe we're not meant to jump there yet. <laughs> where the footprints are, mystical. That's where you should be going. Yeah, I'm 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 keen to do Fantasy Star Zero. It'll be my first DS game on stream. How do we get up there, you reckon? Is it just a case of Trying hard. There you go. We try hard, we can achieve anything, people. Oh, look, it even stopped this one spinning to make our lives easier. Oh, you're, you're, you're an aggressive one. I thought we were going to have a chat. No, the pawn. No. I hope it's okay that I went and got fresh... Uh, fresh samples for those sound alerts rather than it being just from the stream actually use the playstation share capability would you believe it we can't jump that far ah oh, for crying out loud one more to go there we go oh jeez 
Glad I didn't test my arm. Oh, tell you what, though, this has been a long time coming. Last time. What? The hearts and ponds disappeared into that pillow. I've got the magnet hat on and everything. What the hell? Anyway. We've got our baseball bat still. We're in classic kid clothing rather than Nikuza Metro gear. I forgot to I forgot to take a selfie with my little mask and ear combination last time. And now they're a bit uh, Now they're a bit sad looking, so I gotta remember to, you know, do that just to help promote the stream, you know? If you gotta dress up, why not? Why not take a photo? Because I tell you, Fair Star Zero, I don't have any cowboy hats or anything. <laughs> the main character has a cowboy hat? Or at least somebody does. Does that stop everything? It did. Okay. Oh, look at how look how relaxing this is compared to that deep sea rubbish. It's a chill bit of platforming. This is this is what I'm here for. I'm here for fun. Platforming and RPGs in a day. That's a good way to spend a day off work. Jazz Remix. Now the problem with the other time rift is that it's in a very annoying stage. But we should be able to just rush to it. Here in the different chapters, or want to hear us practice? Want to swap out some of the music you hear? All right, listen to this one. I don't understand how that musical interface works. <laughs> Okay, the big parade. Speaking of cool outfits for Hat Kid, the conductor outfit's pretty good. Are we going to be using our, our baseball bat for this instead? Now, I'm just going to ignore the DJ. I'm looking for a penguin and a time rift. It ain't here. Yeah, I had, I had yesterday off as well, but that on uh, on a Monday, my wife only works for a couple of hours, so it's more of a case of just chilling out, waiting for her to get home. I ended up playing Murder by Numbers, which I got free off the Epic Game Store forever ago. And I was like, oh, this one, my daughter's done this one. <laughs> this one kind of sucks. Uh, you want to know why it kind of sucks? Because the band came with us. Where's our, where's our, come on, where's our proper hat? No, we do not have the conductor's hat. What is the point? Yes, the band will be following us. And I, I played, end up playing Murder by Numbers because, you know, part of the reason I want it, it looks cool. The art style. That kind of modern anime inspired art style and it you know it's inspired by ace attorney games and i did not and i should have probably figured it out on my own but it's mostly picross <laughs> so that's all it's forcing me to get better at picross because uh, i play picture cross on my phone but that lets you have let you buy some hints like by the outer ring of the puzzle, stuff like that. But in Murder by Numbers, you get a bonus for not using any hints. And you have a detective ranking. And I'm like, 
I'm just gonna pop the heater on. And it's like, well, if it's got if it's got to do with points and score and ranking, I'm not using hints. Get out of here. But yes, the band still do horrendous damage and a massive knockback, so. Didn't time that nicely. Just gonna time that jump. So this would be a nice relaxing time rift, except the band is after you. But because there is a, you know, a complete chasm beneath us, you can make them fall into the abyss. They, they just come back. They, they leash to you. But if you fall, they come with you. Look at them. Demonic owls. <laughs> spectacular spectacular man you're absolutely right I would have them banned disbanded disbarred <laughs> welcome in I hope you're doing well see there they go plunging into the abyss but they'll be back they're never far away ah ah they get ahead of me There we go. It's not fair that I had practice at this one. It was a while ago, but I had practice. There we go. What has happened to that fence? Oh, did you see that? <laughs> the fence got big. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. All that sort of gear. Oh, that's a gold trophy. Look at that. Let's have a, let's have a remix. Remix. A remix has been unlocked for the time rifts. Now that we don't need to go back to them. <laughs> you don't need to go there anymore. But here's a remix. Please go back. Please replay them. I think the remixes are auto applied. That's why they're all ticked. But hey, let's see. I don't think there's any other time rifts that we have missed, but I'll double check. Double check. Double check. No, nope, Mafia Town's all clear. That's all good. I know subcon's done. Let's just double check. There's no time rift in the final area. <clears throat> She's up to it, by the way. The eldest. She's up to mustache girl. No, nope. all done. Okay, cool. Um, and I'm like, look, you've got half an hour tech time. You are not going to be able to beat her in that amount of time. She doesn't have the doesn't have the uh, hat either. Day 35. Uh, whoops. I don't think anyone saw me do that. Should I come up with an excuse just in case? It was a freak accident. Iceberg just get in the way of the ship sometimes. I really wanted to do it. I think that's the truth. Yes, yeah, so that'll be our last diary entry because we're that's our, we've done our last story mission. Which is finishing seal the deal. So, yes, so speaking of sealing the deal, I've done her a deal where I was like, look, I will play up to the hat girl boss fight and then you can start your, your tech time from there. Okay. We have got 50 time pieces. All that's left is just to finish off Alpine. And I'm happy to say that then Hat and Time is done. The emergency button. Perfectly designed for moments when you need a button to push, but can't find one anywhere else. Can we push it? Yeah, there you go. What's left? Ah, Time Rift, there we go. We will hear the Time Rift remix. Okay. I can't have to go there where that is, too. Need an Alpine Skyline remix. We can spend enough time running around here. 
I do like the conceit of the the beams going into the sky. Oh yeah, did I mention that she doesn't have the time stop hat either? So we're she was doing all right. She was doing okay, but she ran out of time, so. So I'm looking for a red beam. Come on, where's the thing? <laughs> Come on, hookshot. Yeah, I've got it equipped. Come on. Let's we'll start from there, I guess. We've done the Twilight Bell. We've done the windmill. We have not done the... It's like the birdhouse or something? And the lava area. We haven't done the lava area. Whatever that's called. Yeah, we haven't done the boss, so... I don't know what the deal is with the final boss either because I just have not been that far. The birds at the birdhouse steal shiny things. The birds at the birdhouse. Is this the way to the birdhouse? <laughs> well, let's go to the birdhouse. Why not? Bird pass fork. The birdhouse is this way. Okay. That's what I wanted to hear. Oh, okay, wires. <laughs> oh, there is that one more rift token in Yakuza Metro as well that we need the time stop hat for. Make sure you swing towards the path you want. So they say that, and then is there multiple paths here or not? Uh, maybe not. Oh, I think I've gone the wrong way. Serpentine bed horn. I think I've done this already. There's a horn at the top. Well, maybe I haven't. We'll find out. We'll just we'll find out together, chat. Serpentine star. There's bird paws on the walls. Do they need to walk up walls, birds? I thought they could just fly. Own horn sometime. That might be the way to the birdhouse, I hope. You've cleared serpentine bird horn. Serpentine, serpentine. Serpentine? direction. Come on, let me turn, let me turn. No, gotta go back. How's that chain coming out of that baseball bat? Yellow Band Hills. Oh, I do enjoy the Alpine area, just for the chill vibes. I mean, the chill vibes until exploding bird eggs start attacking you, but you know, we'll get there. <laughs> Maybe we should do a shopping spree in Yakuza Metro 2 if we get back there up all the colors and outfits there we go nearly at the birdhouse that's what i want to hear what how are those bushes not solid yeah. 
one of the things like uh, and I know that's what leads to back CDO on Twitch as well. Nick Abani, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. What hour of the day is this, I hear you ask? Just trying to climb. Too much climbing. Good timing. Wanted to go to bed, but I'm a bit down, so I couldn't sleep yet. Oh. Well, let me just say... Hat and time is a great solution to that, I agree. Okay. I was like, I swear the, at some point the seals say, hello, you know, very ooh, -ooh. But no, they, I could not find them saying hello. So I just went, I went, I got welcome aboard instead. Welcome to the, uh, Welcome to the cleanup operation. Yes, there we go. Look at that cool bird. Hey, we've cleared Yellow Band Hills. We're gonna have money solve all our problems. Okay. I guess I wanna go this way. Oh, that might have been a bit ambitious. <laughs> it happens once in a while that most in the evening I'm sad for one to two hours. Vitamin D and sports do better than that. But I couldn't bike the last three weeks because I had to repair it. Oh no, is your bike is your bike fixed? What happened? I know what that's like though, like when I can't go for a walk or go to the gym. Not that I go to the gym anymore, but definitely affects the mood. Okay, I think we have to figure out how to blow things up to get across there. <laughs> Explosives, the cause of and solution to all life's problems. There we go. We have, to build a, we have to build a bridge and get over it. What has that done for us? Anything? I don't believe for a second that Hat Kid doesn't know how to blow things. <laughs> Hat Kid is trained in many terroristic acts. <laughs> She's seen some shit. She's probably in a spaceship flying through, you know, flying through space to uh, avoid the law. <laughs> Fixed just maybe. Well, not fixed, but I can ride tomorrow. 7K is one of my best friend's birthdays. But after that, I'm going to get repaired. Ah, oh, so you, you... What the hell? <laughs> it dropped me off a cliff. There's spare bikes. Oh, great. So I can bike Wednesday. So it'll be a very hot Wednesday. So maybe not. Oh, dear. There's a lot of really big structures up on these peaks. I wonder who built them. Birds don't build birdhouses, right? That's right. Splenda did it. I have nothing left to sell. Please. If you have nothing left to sell, then why would I visit you another time? You're useless to me. You're dead. Dead to me. Hey, crow. What are you doing up here? Well, I guess it is a birdhouse. Well, that makes sense that they essentially have a, you know, a higher car equivalent for bikes. Why not? There's a guy at my work who's a very avid cyclist, I'm sure. Well, he's probably got spare bikes, to be honest. But um, I'm glad they give you more yarn than you need, so. Okay, let's get to the top of the birdhouse. Yeah, no kidding. We've already had one explode on us. Some of these eggs are huge. Almost for breakfast, please. 
The gear shifts are not working mainly. I've been able to repair the repair the rear brake. Oh, that's all good. Based on some people I see cycling, you don't need gears. It's like, oh my god, person riding your bike. Shift the gear. They're, they're going about 2Ks an hour and their feet are doing this. <laughs> it's like, change gears. You could be getting a lot more torque. Is the conceit of the exploding eggs are they eggs that are ready to hatch and when they hatch they explode or have they been affected in some way oh god <laughs> do not knock me off please there's a long way down tell you what the brakes working very important <laughs> you don't want to you don't want to just be relying on the front brakes either that's a good way to go over your handlebars Do they kill each other? Yes! Eat it. Look at that. Best ladder climbing animation in gaming. Best speed too. Way better than the ladders of death in something like Deus Ex. Oh my god. Did not give me a chance. They jump oh god look at that see <laughs> very dangerous you want to explode there thank you superfluous yard well i've not been using gears the last four years what well they're on a good middle ground gear so they don't need to paddle much but uphill is a stress okay that's the whole point is that you make uh you know You make life easier for yourself going uphill with gear shifting. How do we get out there? Aha. Uh -huh. Wait for it to recharge, there we go. If I want to bike to friends 25 kilometers away, good heavens, that's a good, that's a fair ride. Yes, definitely need gears for that and brakes. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. What? Oh, okay, that was my own fault. <laughs> See, all the ponds are back. Nice, Nickabody, nice. I can't tell you how far I used to cycle. It was mostly just to work. Okay. We go over here. Drift token. How do we get inside there? Oh, hello. Hey, big fella. How far is it? Well, how far was it from home to work? Can't remember. We were up here? No! <laughs> That's probably like 15 Ks after three weeks. But I'll see Wednesday if it's hot, then later this week. Fair enough. Don't don't ride when it's too hot. Or take extra water bottles either way. Just trying to figure out how to get up there. Aha. Uh -huh.
Interesting. Maybe I just need to come in from higher up. Our friend there. Are there any further entrances? Oh, look, they're in love. I could do 25 kilometer tours in 30 degrees back then when I did those for half a year already, but not now and not with 33 degrees Celsius. No, absolutely not. And watch out for your own health. I do wonder if there's another way in. Seems like that might be the way. Aha. Aha. There we go. I was overthinking it. Is it a relic or is it another rift token? It's another rift token. Okay. Because I don't think I have anywhere else to put any relics, so. so I'm quite sturdy when it comes to cold weather. I was biking a bit below freezing. The oh, well, that's it. Running or exercising in the cold, that's easy because you heat yourself up. The main trick is not to get sick when you're finished. Oh, stealthy little things. Hiding behind those ponds. There we go. Um, yeah, like with the, the kids swimming that they have, they, they swim all year round. And it's like, you're nice and warm after swimming in the warm water, but then we're going to get home in, you know, three degrees. <laughs> Ponzu sauce. <laughs> Oh, we have to hit up the roof token machine. We've got a few. That one's satisfying. I do enjoy that one. See if that it's too cold. It's indoors. It's indoors with the heated pools. So that's that's all good. It just reminds me one year for our school swimming we went in winter. And it's like, oh it's all good, the pool's heated, but you know, we we're all seven year olds, we didn't know what we we're doing. And lo and behold Everybody got sick that year because we we're all we're drying ourselves properly and all that stuff and then going out in the cold and getting on the bus to get back to school. Yeah, they went they went back to summer swimming after that. Aha. Uh -huh. Straight to the big bird. Of course, there's one more explosive in our way. Why not? Are we meant to? Are we meant to sneak here, or is he just okay? All right, nothing's waking this bird up. Oh, what the hell! Oh no, not the water. The air outside, like the actual temperature outside. Fun fact, being cold does not increase your chances for catching a cold. No, so really? You reckon? Every time my wife gets like even slightly rained on, she swears she catches a cold. <laughs> she wants it to be quiet. Shush, shush, shush. Oh, 
On cold weather, people are more in rooms. Ah, oh, maybe. It's the people being huddled up together is the issue, not necessarily the weather. Okay. That's another one down. Hardest bloody jump in the game, but it is. <laughs> Just trying to figure out. The twilight bell is, this way. is it the twilight bell? I'm trying to remember where those cat houses were. The bell is this way. Yeah, it's pretty counterintuitive, but so is reality. <laughs> yep, that's a good way to put it. Where's our, where's our map thing that will help us? Why that horn already? Might be an annoying place to find Timerus in because it's such a massive area. Ah, oh, we're up here anyway. I'll post a vid on it in the Discord by SciShow. Good lads, very high standards for research. We're all about high standards for research here. Do your own research, but also get it peer reviewed. That's the Twilight Bell. Okay, that is not where we need to be. We've done the Twilight Bells, that's okay. Hope you like that kid swinging on ropes. This is the bird house. So okay, we just we just went this way. We know there's no time rift this way. Can't grab onto it mid, mid thing. <laughs> Goat refinery? No, I don't think that's what we want either. I feel like we should just go back to the hub just to double check them. <laughs> Do your own research! Well, hello there. <laughs> Would you like to see my journal articles? The sound list is getting longer. Maybe we should just use a telescope, why not? Right, that just looks at the twilight bell. That's it. <laughs> okay. Let's try this direction. Or we go to the lava. We've done the old windmill, so that's okay. Pulls up the journal articles out of the wallet. <laughs> it's kind of FBI agent. Scientific American. <laughs> what other journals are they? Sizzling lava split. <laughs> there was trouble at the old mill, and we solved it. It's all good. This heat is great. Oh, it's even 
even harder to the right. Yeah, this bit's tricky. And it's entirely because you need the game to tell you when you can jump off the spiders and then it bounces you the wrong way. Come on. Scrub. Lava cake. Sounds delicious. I like how some of the flags are burnt. Trouble with the old meal. Oh. Ember Summit. I'm sure that's one of the kids at school's name. <laughs> Certainly a cake man out of lava. Lava cake is a cake you too early. <laughs> what? Give me hearts. Give me hearts. Give me hearts. Oh, daddy. Let me in. Let me in. Get over there? Oh no, I know where that is, okay. My wife makes this amazing, what do you call it? Self-melting chocolate pudding? Oh. That kind of chocolatey sponge on the outside and the melting chocolate in the middle. Mwah. Beautiful. You said it. What the hell? <laughs> We're gonna look a bit smoky by the end of this. Interesting, lots of spaces for collectibles there. That's a real lava cake, yeah. Well, maybe it's only a name that in the UK. I don't know. Food has really weird regional names in English, for sure. How the place like this anyway? no, they're definitely called lava cakes here, too. Back when we were uncultured uh, swine, we'd eat Domino's. Domino's pizza, and my wife would always insist we get the chocolate lava cake as well. She was mostly on board for the chocolate lava cake rather than the pizza, which is fair enough because the pizza ain't that great. Domino's in Australia used to do chicken wings for a while, like, and the chicken wings are better than the pizza. And they don't do the chicken wings anymore, so it's like, what's the, what's the good here? Domino's? God, I've got to stop talking, but to make myself hungry. And considering we're playing the stream for most of the day, I don't want to make myself hungry. Nobody needs to see me eat on stream. <laughs> this is clearly a safe place for a child to be. <laughs> Stuff like bangers and mash I get, but spotted dick. 
Like, really? <laughs> I'm sure there's an etymology behind it, but yeah. What is this all leading to? Why does this take me away? Treasure? Where are we? I'll come back to you later, lava cake. Probably just a rift token, but hey. I can I can't support Domino's because there is a local pizza shop where these two exist. Yes, exactly. Go go to your local, they'll always be better. I mean I would go to the dock if I had something like that. <laughs> I swear, baby, I got the spotted dick from a toilet seat. Yeah, we go we go to the local pizza place now. They they're very good. There is a local pizza place that's actually not very good, but hey, they try. <laughs> toilet cake. <laughs> I bet the spotted dick. What if the etymology was actually just someone to say, <laughs> I'm gonna call this spot a dick? Maybe. <laughs> Hang on, let's 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 be accurate here. Oi bruv. That looks like a bit of a spot of dick, innit? I know what we'll call it. We'll call it a spot of dick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there you go, that's my bad British impression for the day. Mark it off on your bingo cards. Now, we've got yarn to our left with the Dweller Mask. Is that a knife? Are we standing on a giant knife? Trivia, etymology. Spotted is a reference to the dried fruit in the pudding, which resembles spots. Dick and dog were dialectical terms widely used for pudding from the same etymology as dough, i.e. the modern equivalent name would be spotted pudding. Wrong, it would be spotted dick. Spotted. <laughs> we're on a giant knife. Okay. There you go. We've learned something today. Always education. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, I'm not ready to deal with those platforms again yet. Oh no, that's not the power button. Did that give us any health? No. I still bet someone just thought Spider Dick would be funny. I agree, absolutely. No giant knife like every Australian? I do not have a giant knife, no. Biggest thing I've got is a carving knife. And that's not a knife. This is a knife. No giant machetes here, unfortunately. Those pillars coming out of the lava look awesome. What have we got? There's a the timepiece. Oh, we need the dollar mask. <laughs> oh, we've timed that poorly. Oh, I landed. I landed on the pillar, I swear. Where was our last checkpoint? Your life isn't like the adventures of Bayou Billy? Unfortunately, no. I do almost live in a swamp though. <laughs> I mean wetlands, sorry. Booyah indeed, hat kid. Booyah indeed. Booyah, Billy. Ah, come on. I fat figured the square button. Oh, excuse me. I needed, the I needed the power recharge badge there and I did not have it equipped. One sec.
completed the lava cake. She said, completed. And the hay fever continues. The illness has spread. Oh, Sarah was so chill. We haven't done the timer yet either. Yes, this is the finale. Why nobody did anything about these flowers? <laughs> I'll never know. Okay. I don't know much about the goats up here, but we tried to give them a wide berth. If you get in their way, they uh, tend to be a bit pushy. <laughs> You don't want to talk about the, the evil flowers? Nope. Okay. Sure. So I guess we're going on a flower pruning mission. One per area. There we go. Now I could use a giant knife. That would help with the uh, pick of the flowers, wouldn't it? Okay. Which way do we want to go? Left, maybe? Well, technically where I live was wetlands too. That's why one side of the apartment house, which is only three apartments high, but eight apartments plus four stairs across, so quite long. It's thinking on one side, the top floor is getting cracks in the wall for 15 years now. And outside of our flat, most also get bursting windows. Oh my Lord. Really to be right on top of there. I'm guessing we need to go this way, actually. Oh, shit. I thought we could jump on those flagpoles. This is the deadliest area in the game, by the way. <laughs> Straight up. It's solely because the bloody detection for those square prompts is not the best. lava cake I'm worried about is that flower. So how do we get over there? You like the NX prompt? Ah, oh, boo. We're not bursting, but cracking. It still needs to be changed. Yes, yes. The, the heat and humidity warp the glass and cause cracking. All of our window seals are bloody in terrible condition. Our house doesn't, you know, keep the heat in well. Okay. Let's go this way first. So how do we get over there? Not the heat with us, but the one-sided sinking house causing stress. Ah, okay. So the movement of the house is what's causing the cracking because the actual house is shifting. That's what was happening with my, my parents' house. It being on a very, very slight incline. But over 40 years, it was slowly sliding down the hill. Big fella. <laughs> I 
He's just sleeping it off. He'll be fine. It's very emo. Over 40 years slowly slide over. Ooh, is that more yarn? Sure is. Why not? Why not get more yarn? What? Ah! Ah! Oh, kid! Kid! <laughs> Where does that put us? Oh man! Where even are we? Ah! Oh. What? I don't think I'm meant to be here. Man, now I don't know how to get back up where I was. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now we're back on track. I don't know where we ended up. Heat cracks are usually only if you get sudden changes. Glass is quite heat resistant in such temperatures. Just shouldn't pour ice water on windows in 40 degree weather. Yes. Oh, I know, this will cool the house down. Crack. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? You've really got to make it on top, on top of it in the first go, don't you? There we go. I wish I had the spring in my step that Hat Kid does. Maybe 20 years ago. <laughs> Tune into the Mystical Machine Gun stream and hear an old man complain. Ah, <laughs> oh, there you go. We've cleared the Ember Summit. Now. So let's get the hell out of here. Oh, go descending is terrifying. <laughs> okay. Come on, you can make a kid. Yes. Now, flower in that direction. Let's try that way. And young people complain too. Yes. We've got the spectrum covered. Don't worry. We just need somebody over 80 to suddenly start to discover streaming and then we can have the full range of ages. I'm pretty sure I can't take the ones that have that on them, can we? Yep, can't can't use those if they've got the bad flowers on them, so we must need to go elsewhere. Super easy going back because they're lower. Okay. So this isn't really a, a boss fight, it's just kind of tour the area one more time. Uh oh, evil yak. He's itchy, that makes him angry. I'm surprised my eldest coped with this so well with the lightning and thunder. I guess she's okay if it's a video game. Uh, where are there any flowers? What? I pressed square, I swear. We need more we needed more pun characters like the octopus and the in seal the deal. He was good. Okay. 
want to go left. I do believe there's a flower to our left. Well, this is the ponds. Oh, jeez. What the fuck? Okay, don't use the ladder. <laughs> Remember someone who also raised you. I don't know their name. Something. Oh, Retro Interocitor. Yes. Was I was over sixty? Maybe over seventy? I, I don't think. I don't know if Retro is over seventy. I remember them saying they were already adult in the early eighties when playing Defender for the first time. Yes, Retro is. Uh, retro is Retro for sure. I don't know if he's over seventy though. <laughs> There's only one way to do it, really. This is where accusing them of being old. <laughs> Let's see if I spell it correctly. Yes, that's the right one. No, he's, 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 he's lovely. He's intermittent streamer. Sometimes plays War Thunder. Sometimes plays very retro stuff. But good for a chat. Good for a chat. That's all. That's what we're looking for. Right, next flower. Jeez, that took ages. Jesus, these flowers are not fucking around. Maybe I should be using the sprint hat. But the sprint hat doesn't look as cool. Peter with a baseball bat. That's how I do all my gardening. Blowing the horn of Gondor. To arms! Do the time rifts exist in this version? I'm not sure. Probably not. You probably don't want to interrupt your trying to finish this area by doing a time rift thing and getting kicked out and having to do it all again. So most likely I'd say they're not here. Being old in itself is not bad. Cringe and boomer takes are strongly correlated, but not exclusive to old age. Absolutely. I know some 30 year old boomers for sure. Essentially, if you find yourself saying kids these days, wrap it up. Wrap it up. It's over for you. You're old. <laughs> This way? I think we did. I mean, I heard people around my age saying kids use that. Exactly. And when people talk about kids these days, they're, they're talking about like 18 year olds. So they're not even talking about kids, really. My kids are at school. They, they play Red Rover. They don't, <laughs> they're not on TikTok or anything like that that, you know, people complain about. Challenging myself to the hardest part for some reason. Okay, let's just. Nope, you've got to bounce. You've got to bounce. Back in my day, kids, we. <laughs> that is technically true. I hope this keeps our cleared flowers. Oh, jeez. Oh, I bet it doesn't. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. Ugh, we'll find out very soon. Come on. 
Got to do this now. I really believe that millennials being different because they went through the internet with older people telling them that and complaining about such attitudes. And now they're saying that too. In a bit fewer numbers, but still. It's, there's always going to be people like that. There's always going to be, be people like that who hold on to the past or have an idealised version of the past and think that whatever way they did it was better. Um, you know what I mean? Even though nobody's perfect. No generation is amazing. No generation is perfect. It's just... Yeah, there's a, there's a burger doing there. Why is there a burger just sitting here? <laughs> Give me the burger. You know, as long as it's not hurting anybody, let them do what they want. Let them say Riz and other other terms you don't understand, you know? If I go the wrong way, there's no flowers out here. Yeah, no flowers here. What is glowing up there? Is that a bit of yarn I missed or something? Right, gotta focus on the flowers. I really have hopes for Gen Z. I think like I'm one of a few people who are actively amazed at the societal progress of Gen Z. Absolutely agreed. Unfortunately, there will be uh, always be things that people find wedges to, you know, get people to discriminate against each other. But are we on the right side? Oh. We are not on the right side. On the wrong side. Gonna do it again. Sorry, buddy. Don't hurt us, thankfully. <laughs> Gen Z doesn't want to work. Nobody wants to friggin' work. Work sucks. NZ doesn't want to work, says the, the boober on Facebook who is Facebooking at work while not doing their actual job. Because <laughs> they've uh, been around long enough that they've gotten into middle management and don't have to do anything. Oh my god. There we go. Secret back path. God, camera. <laughs> what are you doing, camera? Hey, we fixed it. I even heard that in person by Gen X or maybe late boomer. Is it over? The air is clear again. And the ghosts seem to have come to their senses. 
Is again. <laughs> I don't really understand it, but I assume we have you to thank. Oh, I keep calling them yaks. The goats. We Lord. found this in a cluster of those flowers after they wilted again. You were pretty insistent on going after the others, so I guess it belongs to you. Uh, thank you for helping us. There we go. We haven't got the trophy yet because there's a couple of time risks to do. But Alpine is just about done. Look at that. They have no more telescopes to show us. Somebody complained that he heard to pay for his physiotherapy education himself and I was like, wait, and you want that to remain? Yeah, exactly. Oh, I had to pay for my schooling. It's like, yeah, that sucked, didn't it? <laughs> Wouldn't you want it to be free for other people? Hell, make housing free. I had to pay whatever for my house. I don't give a shit. <laughs> All right, let's get those time rifts. I wish you could just look at the pictures of the time rifts while you're in the map. I'm jealous, so it has to still suck, so I'm not jealous. <laughs> oh dear, I know exactly what you mean. Okay. We're missing a badge as well. What badge are we missing? Well, whatever the badge is, we can get it from the Metro anyway. Alright, we're on a time rift hunt. There'll be a lot of standing still. We know it's not at the birdhouse, so that's fine. The one one we saw was next to a red beam. That's a green beam. Green beam. There's a red beam, but that's very far away. Funny thing, that group of boomers grew up in the GDR, and because of that this has an allergic reaction to the word socialism. Fair enough. But I can almost get them on board by saying workplace democracy instead of socialism. That's not a bad way to put it. Now, a hat in time, alpine, time rifts. Not the purple one.
Farmer's locations, here we go. Spawn at the Twilight Bell and turn around. It's on top of a nearby tree. Okay, so I kept ignoring the friggin' Twilight Bell. That's where it was. So in both cases, they say it's better to spawn there. <laughs> oh, well. Spawn at the Twilight Bell and turn around. Let's do that. Nearly there. Just listen to explaining concepts in the worlds people want to hear. There's this guy at my work who does not like unions, even though he stands for everything that unions stand for. But apparently had some bad experiences with a single union, so he doesn't like unions. It's like, dude. Look at that. Straight away. I have nothing. Quiet. Is this the remix? Yeah, some words will be like thought terminating cliches. Thought terminating, good way to put it. Well, hell. <laughs> Thought terminating cliche is in fact jargon. Can't see where the next guy is. Just jump around him. Oh. I don't want you near me. Okay. Whoops. Idiot. <laughs> oh, nobody said I was a smart man. There we go. Easy one. Nice and quick. <laughs> oh, this game looks cool. It's a Souls like. I don't like it. Dude, what the? You, you just said you liked it. <laughs> Ooh. Our collection of cat hats continues. That's thought, that's thought terminating cliche outside politics. Oh, yeah. Anybody says they don't like any single genre. It's like, have you played every single game in that genre? Like, I'm not asking you to. But if you just say, I don't hate, I hate every single puzzle game. It's like, are you sure? Are you sure? <laughs> okay. Don't make me actually pay attention while we're swinging. Okay, where is that cat house? There it is. I think this is where we need to be. Take care, kid. 
There's invisible cats around. I can see him. It does nothing for me, but I can see him. Is this it? What the hell? Where's that one further up? Taking my cat hat. What do you think this is? I can just hear it. Curly tail trail. Oh, we need the ice hat. Also a bit adjacent to self-fulfilling prophecies. You say you won't like it, and so it will be because you formulated your opinion beforehand. Oh, God, yes. Now with rightoid orgs or something like that, that fair with art, that's a bit weird. My kids do it with food. They just assume they're not going to like it, so they never try it. Drives me crazy. Oh, for Christ's sake. Oh, no. My hat is gone forever. What the fuck? Uh. Right, well, that sucks. What the fuck? Uh, I can't get my hat back. It fell into the abyss. So I have no hats. Like, that's it. It's over. Game over. We're soft locked forever. We have no hats. We have lost the conceit of the game. <laughs> that is just, come on. That's just no testing. Yeah, best thing not to push them. They'll come around eventually when they're older. I didn't try broccoli since I was five because I was forced to, You were forced to eat it. Good Lord. There we go. Got our hat back. Got to do all that again. What a load of shit. God. What's the bet that cat's going to steal our hat again? So we got... We, got, we hit him. <laughs> uh, beep. In time. That's just... Come on, I had to think that was a possibility in the void. And there's multiple easy ways to fix it. Just if you hit him, you automatically get your hat back. You don't have to physically pick it up. so close <laughs> wait where are we now ah <laughs> oh. okay different spot that's okay Oh, that, okay. That was a bit weird. Like, not physically forced, but if a kindergartner... Yeah, kindergartner, yeah. Says you to eat it, you can't go outside and play if you don't eat it. Oh, yeah, exactly. Oh, that's forced, for sure. Yeah. 
Where am I going next? Well, that's the worst part. Why, why can I not hit them if I know they're coming? Like... You know what I mean? Let's just fuck the player. Shit. Oh, you can see them and you can swing your bat at them, but <laughs> you still can't hit them. Anyway. Try again. Now that is force. Force and bribes and all that fun stuff. <laughs> VR with the raid. Welcome, 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 welcome. Good evening yourself. How was dot hack today? Uh, G U you're on. What am I doing? What are my commands? <laughs> Almost done with vo what volume one. Okay, good to hear. Well, good to hear. Okay. Okay. Now. Okay. See that one killed us instead. This is fucked. This is a stupid thing. God. Unbelievable. Look, and now we're bugged. Now our animation's busted. We. <laughs> this game sucks. <laughs> oh, that cat stole our hat. That cat stole our hat, and then we. It we attacked it, and it fell into the void. And the hat went with it. And so we just had no hat. And we had to quit the level. I don't know. Maybe I'd be the greatest... I would, maybe I would be the greatest broccoli person. Since I like all things cabbage like cauliflower. And that kind of looks like it. But I'm not putting it in my mouth because I feel I'd vomit. Oh no. Oh no. Now nah, broccoli... Bro well. Broccoli's nice. Hello, hello. <laughs> Cat in the hat stole the hat, exactly. Oh, they're there again. Oh, fuck these things. I don't care about the ponds. Just don't knock me into the abyss, please. Is this where they... Is this their, is this their monster closet? Is this where they spawn from? They just live in the void. There's another one. See? Can't hit them. See them coming. Swing your bat all day long. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. We made it. We made it. We made it. This is it. Last rift. Last rift. The void. Another gold trophy for the for the cabinet. <laughs> there we go. The blood moon. There you go. <laughs> Alright. We are pretty much done. With a hat in time for my money. We will go get that one Rift token in Yakuza Metro. We'll buy all the colours and stuff in there. What? Oh no, there's always more. Ooh, look at us. Whenever I ask people how broccoli tastes compared to other things, if there are maybe cauliflower notes for other things in its taste, okay. How does broccoli taste? Broccoli is pretty tasteless on its own. I wouldn't compare it to cauliflower. Like the texture is similar to cauliflower. Um. God, it's been a little while since I've had broccoli. You, you want to know? You want to know the way not to have it? One way my wife does it because her, her grandmother's Italian and likes lemon and stuff. They put lemon in it as like, ugh, it's just sour. It tastes like the spokesperson for vegetables. <laughs> uh, very good, very good. All right, let's go shopping. I can't believe that, you know, the time stop hat is essentially for the final boss. And I really found no other uses for it, aside from maybe a rift or two here. Okay. 
Is there a combo we haven't found yet? Nope. I think we've eaten everything there is to eat. And again, I don't want to make myself hungry. <laughs> you don't want to see me eating on stream. It sounds more like green peppers. I never knew anyone who liked green peppers more than red. And if you are such a person, you are probably... We only ever get red caps, I don't... Uh, yeah. I can, I, I can eat uh, raw red capsicum. Oh, peppers, get out of here. <laughs> now, where is that thing? Oh, there's a sales cat this way. Let's go talk to them. Oh, we're going to have the guy for you, one. Yes, look at that. We're going to drive his dine-ins and dives. <laughs> okay, we've bought everything he's got. Oh, we don't throw a burger. Boo. Oh, there's fish grates. Look at that. Now, where is the time stop thing I'm looking for? It wasn't here, no. I probably told a story already how I threw green pepper slices no one wanted to eat at a garden party at the bonfire with words. Disrespect, disrespect. That is disrespectful serving green peppers at your garden party. Just gotta get across there, that's all we gotta do, peeps. All we gotta do. Okay. Look at that hat. Oh my god, that's amazing. Look at that. There we go. Got our rift token. Got our DJ Groove sticker. What does, what does DJ Groove say? Dali. Oh yeah, got to still get out. Sure. All right, let's roll. Let's do some shopping and go do that time rush. Topic approved. What if the sport them because she thought maybe someone might want them? One of my best friends broke off the friendship four years after. Was that because of the green peppers? No, maybe. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, why are we wearing this time stop hat? That's so cool. That'll pair well with our Yakuza jersey. Oh, look at that. That is a good look. That is a good fit. That is a good fit. Look at that. For 10 minutes. I'm selling the latest and greatest. Retro BR badge. Wah, wah. She is great, but she likes green peppers and she had to go after four years. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> it me. I'm a badge. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man, I can't see. I don't know if I can have this for very long. <laughs> I 
Where is that for us? Oh, I don't know if I can use this for very long. <laughs> this is pretty terrible. You sell anything? Hey, kid. Do you know it used to be really empty around here? <laughs> Back when there was just one train line, there was barely any, like, stores and stuff. But once a lot more people started using the trains, the place got way busy. That's right. If you build it, they will come. My eyes! Hey, who the fuck put on the virtual boy? This is a badge. The Retro VR badge. There you go. Let's take that off, shall we? Stay where pick pork it's about. Okay, can I not talk to you guys? Oh, I guess not. I guess I've bought all your stuff. I don't have over-ear headphones at the moment for my phone. It's a shame. I like those. Uh, who? Where else is there a cat selling things? What do we think? I can think of a plate. Just one more, maybe. Look at that. Look at the easy mode. I guess that's a use for it. A use case for the time stop hat. Okay, I think we've heard that before. Is using time stop broken dialogue? Oh. Green bean. Dignified. Is that meant to be, uh, what is it called? Burberry. Told a friend lately that there is a Virtual Boy emulator where you can make the color scheme black and white like Game Boy. Huh. Never thought of that. Literally the first thing I would have thought of. It's green and white, isn't it? Green and black? Obnoxious. <laughs> well, I know what color we got to stick with. That's a classy dweller mask. Look, the headphones glow. Game Boy players white. Oh, that's true. In it. Oh my gosh, look at us. We're, we're an artiste. OG Game Boy is green. We got all our cool hats. We got so many cool hats. Maybe Game Boy Pocket was black and white. Maybe. I can't recall. I was trying to think. I think there was somebody selling stuff down there as well. Is there a vendor down here? Yes. I'm selling the latest and greatest. Take a look. Fortress. Battlements. Very aggressively. GB on GBA is definitely black and white. Okay. The Justice. Why is that the justice? I'm not sure. Yeah, first one I have is a Game Boy Color. Comfy sweater, it's like a pillow that you can climb inside. I had one of the see-through ones. Remember see-through controllers? Oh, they were the best. Shiny. 
then we are out of ponds. We spit them all. There you go. We have got, we've done our shopping spree. Did we ever go in this way? There you go. Oh, she was, she actually shows her card. Look. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Got your hat, kid. Using a Metro Pass. Pass. OG Game Boy is also not green and black, but some sort of smear when it actually. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's get out of here. We've got one more time rift to go. One more time rift to go. And then we can start Fantasy Star Zero. Oh, oh getting excited over here. That'd be a good excuse to have a quick blue break and stuff as well. Perfect handheld for RPGs, they stand mostly still. Absolutely. PS Zero is a fun one. Oh, I'm glad to hear it. I'm I'm glad I'm glad to be playing something other than Fantasy Star Universe. <laughs> if that makes sense. Because what what did we have? We had PSU, PSU. AOI and then portable which is pretty much you know more universe with the, same, with the characters from universe and everything else so you know that's enough that's enough hours of universe I don't know how many rift tokens we got it's not the greatest but it's decently fun I played it to completion in two weeks and don't remember a damn thing from it okay Ooh, we got the steampunk hat. There you go. Wonder how I wonder how long it is in the grand scheme of things. Because these handheld RPGs, they can get very long. What color is this? Captain of the Sea. Missed our chance. Captain of the Sea? Did you say Captain of the Seal? Sorry, I'll stop spamming those. <laughs> Decent links to it. Oh, okay. Well, that's why we're starting it today, because it's, uh... Oh, there's an octopus coming out of it. <laughs> oh, we're the Lakers. Look out. The big appetite. Long? Only played... Not enough tokens. Oh, okay. How many tokens we got? Okay. We got one time rift to go. I'm gonna do it dressed very strangely. Look, look at that mean mugging she does. You can't see because of the mask when we wear the other hat. All right, let's go. Got our headphones on, we're ready. Pearl was good. Yeah, most Pokemons are good. You can't really go too far wrong. Okay. Time Rift Tour. Ugh. That sounds... <gasps> what? My favourite is still Ruby, but I have a special connection to Pearl. I played on launch here, found some event Pokemon before they came out using a walk through walls code and ninja walking in the ocean. You're a sapphire kid. Gen 3 was great. Okay, our tent doesn't seem to be there. What would be my favorite? I'm not sure. Fire Red, maybe? Because it's the original, but with, you know, nicer graphics and stuff. This could be a long time rift, everybody. Just strap in. Is there pictures in this one? We won't know until we find one.
Blooming idiots. There you go. What's a hat? What's a, it's a burger? <laughs> She's a burger hat. There we go. Rift crown. Aha. Nine. Okay. We're, we're definitely going to try and get the pictures for this one. It may recap the entire game for us. I'm not sure. Leaf Green was my longest game type. 635 hours. Yeah, because after you beat it, there's that whole... The islands and stuff, right? Borga King. <laughs> yeah, I, I never did the extra... The bonus islands and stuff. I, I've, I'm, I'm sure if I picked up my fire red cart right now, that's probably where I am. How good, though, was the fire red... And Leaf Green. How good was just the... Here's what the last thing you did in the game was. Like, it gives that little recap when you load your save. Every game should have that. And it's in black and white. And it's like, last time you went to the Poke Center and all that sort of stuff. Most hours I have in Pokemon was competitive Gen 3. Oh, right. You maxed the timer out. 999, eh? I'll always have a soft spot for yellow. Yellow was my first one. I was watching the Pokemon cartoon before school in the morning. I had a yellow Game Boy. No, I didn't have a yellow Game Boy. My friend had a yellow Game Boy. Let me let me just correct myself there. I had the C3 one, which I already mentioned. I had the purple C3 Game Boy. And my friend had uh, had Pokemon, so we, we traded. So I could evolve my Alakazam, my Abra. Uh, you, you had to trade Kadabra to get it to be an Alakazam and in red, blue, green, yellow in the first gen, Psychic was broken. And that Alakazam and Psybeam carried me through the Elite Four, no drums. Our town only had their first Burger King when I was like 15. So I was fascinated since Burger King is way more fancy than the Mickey D's. That was also way before those local burger shops popped up. That sounds like gen one, all right, it is, exactly. All right. Uh, we've got two Rift Crowns. We've got two pieces. Let's keep searching. Is this our Time Rift remix music? I'm not sure. Anything else to find, you think? I think we're all good. I think we've done everything here. There's not much other, not much other terrain to explore. Oh, we've got to stop talking about food. <laughs> I stopped my way through Ruby Elite 4 with just Blaziken. Oh, Blaziken rules. That Kung Fu chicken. Little hat wearing girl. If found, we give fish to you. Okay. Drug time. It's just bad enough. <laughs> Oh yeah, Blaziken was my OP, my main go-to. All right, we're back in the birds. Back with the Battle of the Birds. What? What hurt me then? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, they're on, they're on alert. Got it. It was not clear with the colour scheme. And I love the German name of Blaziken, Logok. <laughs> My team coverage was so nutty in Gen 3, I didn't know. You didn't even need a sixth? That's pretty good coverage. Comfy sweater, shall we? There we go. If 
only had a comfy sweater with a coffee mug on it, we could do some more cosplay. Ah. <laughs> Slot six was just empty for intimidation factor. <laughs> Blaziken is the team. There's no I in team, but there is an I in Blaziken for sure. Oh my god. Oh, so we do need to get over there. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, what the shit. <laughs> oh, we're gonna go all the way over there. Okay. At least there's no bears chasing us around, so that's some relief. Conductor? There is no iron team, but there are four in individual genius. <laughs> okay, do I have to go up here next, do you reckon? What do you, what do we got? Is there anything up there? No, we should just go up higher, I think. Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that's right. Does that mean we have to do it all again? Oh, it does. We do have to do it all again. Alright. Oh, that's just... Not a big fan of that stealth mechanic. It should just be they chase you or something. Like the punishment is you may get damaged, not... Oh, I missed it. I missed it. There's actually one up there. Yeah, that, that's a sound alert command we're going to have to explain at some point. <laughs> Well, you've been streaming for a long time and you have uh, some chat commands. Do you want to explain kid murder to us? <laughs> Was this a joke? Was this a joke? Okay, can't go that way. There's a chance to explore some more just in case. Just in case. Death water? No. But I can't cross there. Okay. Oh, get fucked. Like, there was no time given to do anything about that. Hat Kid had to do her animation, and that's it. That was it. She just had to do her animation first. See? Ugh, okay, maybe not. I'm going to continue blaming the game, though. Sorry. <laughs> it's all the game's fault. Certainly a giant brick wall. Okay. So I should kill these guys to see if I can get a heart out of them. Of course we won't, but you know. I'm not in favour of murder. I'm in favour of murder, which is like murder, but with cardboard displays. <laughs> Oh, 
always feel slightly ripped off when there's nothing in those exploding containers. Okay. See, here's a use for time stop. Look, the colours are here, they're just hidden. Is there anything hidden on this side? Nope, okay. Nope, we still want explosives. Any hidden ledges or anything? No. Spiffy Steph, how you doing? Welcome in. You have blue sky too? I do have blue sky too. Why not? There's so many. So many to choose from. Okay, hang on. Cool headphones on. So that was just me being blind. Look at the conductor, looking sharp. How do we get up there? I'm going to continue. I'm always looking for cool people to follow on Blue Sky as well. Spiffy stuff. So feel free to drop the uh, drop the link if you want to. Uh, is there any other pages? So this leads over there. So I don't think that's, that's just an extra pond for your trouble. Oh, that's cool. Aha, there's another rift crown up there. I'm not seeing any other, any other pages though. Just gave you a follow. There you go. I can follow back. You can follow me back later if you want to listen to my ramblings. <laughs> you can you can you can follow me for the like once a month like a joke post and then the rest of the time just spruiking myself. <laughs> okay, was that a page? Okay. What about Oh, we're gonna get back up. No, oh, I'm gonna get back up. Let me back up. Any other potential hiding places for pages? I don't think so. Looks pretty well covered. Five to go. Oh, the music's getting spooky. Are we going to go back to the metro? Are we going to go to seal the deal? I'm guessing we will. Are we going to have rift seals? Hello, we have to destroy you now. Okay, five out of nine. We're looking all right. Artis. Why is the hat yellow though? It doesn't go with my outfit. We go down here? We can. Probably should have done something to not die, but you know. Oh, this is where we need to go to move on to the next area. Okay. We need five. Okay. We do not need to be here yet. Hey, spooky bat guys. Oh. We 
Verbo, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Good morning to you. Ah. How do we get up there? There we go. There we go. Gosh. Okay. Coming back here later. We do not need to be here just yet. Thrill in darkness and silence in the night. What a thrill! Oh, there we go. Already done. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot to tell a story from today. Was it my psychiatrist's office when she got a phone call and she asked if I might take it? I have unlimited time, so I agreed. And it was a headhunter. Figure that because she. That, well, I am an assistant medical director, so you would need to offer head physician. Oh, wow. That'd be an interesting conversation to listen in on. All right, I forgot it's morning over there, isn't it? It's night time here in the States. It is 11, 12 a.m. here in Australia. Well, my part of Australia, anyway. I've got the day off work, so I'm having a special daytime stream. But this is not my usual streaming time. I should, I should have turned on my little message saying exactly that. 4 p.m. Happy afternoon. Give me that heart while we're at it. Oh, almost 4 a.m. God, maybe you should go to sleep, Nick and <laughs> Go to bed. Go to bed. Go to bed. <laughs> that is... Pushing through the next day territory for my money. Okay, we've got six rift tokens. We don't have to hang around, but there's more rift crowns. But there's obviously more still to find, so why not get them? Okay. Snatch is not hanging around. Can't read the sign. 4 p.m. would be like the Pacific Ocean. Like, I don't know time zones. <laughs> I don't know where I don't know where things are in the world. I'm on an island. Unto myself. I think we found all there is to find. That's the tricky thing with these rifts. You have to make the call. Have I found everything? Could the sixth picture page be in here? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. I'll just do a quick quick loop of the edge just in case they're being cheeky the tree is fucked up <laughs> okay I think we're I think we found what there is to find we've done a lap okay let's jump in the well oh, Hawaii has 3.44pm right now there you go not time for rig to start streaming just yet for 12 hours there you go gotta, gotta use the ledges like you do in uh, dark souls 2 just trying to see if there's anything worth seeing back here Looks just climbable enough. Come on, come on. Oh, no, no. Come on, kid. Of 
quarter to nine at night in Texas. Happy Texas. <laughs> Alright, here we go, here we go. Everything's bigger in Texas, including the time zones. Oh my gosh, come on. Come on, we can do it. No, I think they I think the game is telling us you should not be going up here. Oh wait! Oh, oh that was worth it. Oh, persistence pays off. Six out of nine, nice. Three to go. Okay. Well, I got to be at the birthday party only at 6 p.m. So it ain't so bad. But tomorrow I should go to bed earlier again. Well, like I said earlier, I wanted to go to bed at 2 a.m. But too sad to sleep. Yeah. Well, I hope we've I hope we've helped improve your mood with a bit of hat and time. All right. We're in Alpine. So I think we are going to go back to the metro and seal the deal. doing well I think we're I think we found I think we found the hardest picture page look at that two to go I think we'll be okay yeah okay let's not die because then we have to do all of it again is there a hook there there is a hook there okay Now this is the same issue we had with the uh, under the sea rift. Just attrition. It goes on too long and gives you no health pickups or anything. Everything is weird in Australia, including some weird half hour time zones. Yes. Just South Australia and the Northern Territory. Everybody else is on regular time zones. Okay, what have we got? What have we got? We've been over there. That's where we started. We can go on, but I'm sure there's at least one more picture page to find. I feel like they're going to drop. What? Come on, kid. There we go. Oh, hearts. It was worth it. We've also got some areas that don't acknowledge daylight saving time and some that do. Yes, exactly. Queensland don't. They, uh, they get it. Where's my artist hat? Okay. Oh, moving. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Oh, this will be interesting. This will be very interesting. Jump. Oh, geez. Okay. Lucky we survived that fall. Falling was not part of the plan. Is that going to sink down? There we go. Okay. This looks a bit precarious. There we go. Oh, that ice hat platform's gonna come in handy, oh. Hey, see, another picture. We got one to go. It'll be real, real harsh if we don't make it. Okay, we've got two rift tokens. God, do not fall, please. Where was the thing? <laughs> it's down here, I think. The eternal question, how do I get out of here? It wasn't up there. Yeah, 
Yeah, so sometimes parts of the year it's the same time in Brisbane and sometimes it's not. Oh yeah, I've, I have relatives in Queensland, so I was like, what time of the year is it? What time am I calling him? <laughs> What's up there? Is that another rift crown? It is, okay. Oh, might as well grab it, come on. I wonder if we're meant to start from over there. We'll give it a go. Not sure if I can mantle onto it, that's uh, the problem. Oh, we can. Okay, that'll do. That will do. Oh no, we're not going back to the metro. Ah, oh, we're back at, we're at the end of time instead. Ah, oh, well, this might not be a place to wear a sweater. I'm gonna save those hearts, I'm gonna save every heart we can. I think we're gonna need them. Oh, the magnet badge is the best badge in the game. I don't mind telling you. Get out of here. What are you doing? No, no. Oh, okay, this, see, this is why we need every heart we need. Fuck these things. Yeah, eat shit. They move too much, they move too fast. There we go. Oh no, look at all our time pieces. Oh my word, look at these platforms. Are they hammers? I think they are. Okay, what was the point of that? Not sure. <laughs> Or do I have to jump on him? Oh, you have to jump on him. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, do you think we can make that jump? I think we can. I think we can. Oh, that, I knew that was going to fucking happen. <laughs> I saw that coming a mile away. Got to keep an eye out. The Franco regime wanted to show solidarity with Nazi Germany, so they changed their times under Germany's and have stayed there ever since, which really fucks up sleep schedules <laughs> since it only gets dark in summer after 11 p.m. Why do they change it back now? They've had enough time. What is that over there? Is that all the way back at the start? What the hell? All right, well, I guess we're going back to the start. Can we get back to the start? Oh my God, I managed to get myself hit anyway. I'm an idiot. Oh my God, we have to do the whole thing. Fuck, that is the dumbest shit. Oh, that's so dumb. Okay, one sec. <laughs> ah, okay, because of World War One as well. There you go. That is just, like, we had the same issue with the Deep Sea one. That is just the most player-unfriendly decisions you can make. Like, you're not proving anything by doing all this in one life. It's just... Just put a checkpoint in. Like, this... I'm not having fun doing this. I'm just repeating the same shit over again. You know what I mean? It's too long to repeat. I think is the thing. It's like, oh, that makes it harder, but it just makes it tedious. Same reason why I don't play like Iron Man, like Baldur's Gate shit. It's like, okay, you lose all your progress or permadeath. Great. I've completely wasted what little spare time I have. Well done. It's just like, come on, man. We've made it through five separate areas. You could just give us a checkpoint.
Well, you're having fun <laughs> at least. Okay, good. I'm glad you are. Oh, the hype turtle. The hype turtle's a cutie. And yeah, once you know where everything is, it's a bit quicker, but still. Well, Hollow Knight Steel Soul Run, 20 hours with one life. Yeah, bugger that. 20 hours, God. Speedrunning. Okay. Good work, kid. Just jump off the cliff. <laughs> she got herself stuck and went, eh, I'll just leap off. <sighs> okay. I'm rushing and that is a problem. Yeah, part of the reason I stopped doing, uh, trying to get, you know, I stopped trophy hunting for the main part is that some trophies are just go fuck yourself trophies you know do something really irritating it's like well that's not fun i don't want to i don't want to spend my spare time doing that so no i don't think i will do the play continuously for 100 hours trophy or whatever <laughs> whatever it is Get herself a bit stuck sometimes, that kid. There we go. Up. There we go. I think that was everything in here. And yeah, I get it. I get it. You can you can do it a lot faster once you know where everything is, but still. That that's where the what was the guitar here, I think? How many hours that a pause? Oh. Good question. The Bladder of Steel Award Achievement in Rock Band 2. You get this achievement by beating the endless set list without pausing the game or failing a song. <laughs> oh, God. That sounds real bad. Now, got to remember where the pieces are. That's uh, the pages, I should say. Ah. Roughly six hours and 15 minutes long, varying a bit depending on load times. Yeah, that's crazy. See, that's that's not fun. Like if you're a person who likes to challenge yourself, sure. But <laughs> my bladder would not last six hours. That's calling for tennis and tennis and a little little little. I don't know what that word is. <laughs> I'm guessing it's something to do with not peeing for a while. 
Okay. Let's focus up. Okay, there's a crown there. Wasn't there one in one of these towers as well? What? That ceiling isn't real. Aha. There was one up here. Okay. Up to five. We finished this area with six, didn't we? Yeah. Okay. Time to go down the well. I'm not losing any health at it. Please render ladder. Grab on the ladder. Why didn't you grab the ladder? You, you know you're in trouble when when the, the the trophy guide says maybe get a friend over to help you out so you can take a break. Okay. Now the tricky part. Tricky, tricky, tricky part. That's a trick. It is such a trick that they go, there's going to be some parts of this where it makes it feel like you can't climb here anymore. You shouldn't be climbing here. wish it wouldn't let you pick up hearts and you don't need them. It's very hard to uh, save them for later. Oh, that's not fair. They ran into each other, I got caught in the explosion. Okay. Flowers there. Platforms there. I just avoided the cat area, didn't I? Yep. Okay. Rock and roll. Motherfucker. Do this part properly, shall we? Oh, that's harsh. So harsh. Well, there's at least one heart we can pick up. There you go. We're on eight. That's where we were before. Is that platform not moving yet? Huh. It's interesting. Must have to do something to get it started, I guess. In Germany, it's something like tendon sheath inflammation. The English word is a bit... Hang on, better focus. The English word is a bit complicated here. It's an inflammation of the hand tendons, which is really painful and also occurs more often once you get it the first time. Ah, okay. Very hard to say that. How do you find this game? I'd heard of it before, but I haven't seen any gameplay till now. Look. Uh, I like it. It's a, it's a cute game. It's very, like, it's it gets a bit frustrating when you get into the harder areas, but hey, they're the harder areas. They're the more advanced areas. This is the final rift in the whole game. Like, 
this is the final area like this in the whole whole of the game so you know it's hard you gotta sleep oh have a good night think about it hope you get a good rest make sure you get a good early night tomorrow night as well always a pleasure good to have you here waste of heart <laughs> oh. nearing completion nice I expect you'd enjoy Psychonauts then platforming seems similar ah oh, I've played a little bit of Psychonauts but yeah never actually finished that one yeah I know I see exactly what you mean okay can't die till we get some health like the triple jump that hat kid can do is really cool and the movement's really cool but yeah it, it is it does show its colors as a bit of a crowdfunded game at times but it's a bit janky at times but for the most part it's really charming the platforming is really nice That's not fair. Oh, okay. That's right. There's there's two hearts in uh, almost immediately in the next area, so that's okay. Does that platform exist yet? Let's see. Ah, now it exists. Okay. No! <sighs> okay. Breathe, just don't die. Does it have a story going on or is it pure platforming? I like how there's a bit of a leeway if you miss time or jump. Your character, yes, the mantling is good. Your character is, appears grab onto a ledge. Give you another shot at least. There's a little, ah, oh, it's, it's, a, it's a platform game plot. It's really not, doesn't mean much. There's a, there's a bit of a plot with the antagonist, but really, for the most part, it's just randomly random worlds. Shouldn't expect. Oh, there's the last page. How do we get up there? Come on. Mustache girl melting away. Okay. <laughs> now how do we get back to where we need to be? All right. We've got all the pages. We've got three out of four hearts. We are doing okay. I don't want to get knocked off this platform by oh, the fucking owls. <laughs> That's the real, real trick here. The main trick is this uh, triple jump you can do. Oh, that sounds like the rift opened. So we can just we can just book it. We'll just run for the exit. See, it does have a little bit of jank like that. Like, I am meant to be on that. They want that's where they want me to go. Okay. 
Okay, great. We've got all the pages. We've got all the rifts. Oh, that only took two attempts. And it does occasionally have a spooky vibe. Turn home. There you go. The hero. Oh, this is Mustache Girl's story. Mustache Girl with Mustache Dad? Mustache Grandpa? She's happy. And then the Mafia came. Hi, Mafia. Oh, no. All belong to Mafia now. They took over. She tried to fight them, tried to bribe them, or accuse them of taking all the money. Rolled the TNT, and she started her mafia sabotage career. Ah, oh, there you go. So she—that's where she got that from. She took one of their coins. Mm. Poor mustache girl. She start. She started out with uh, good intentions. There we go. There we go. Oh. <laughs> what? This game never fucking ends. Oh, okay, it's a present. <laughs> Why am I down here? Cool. Okay. We got a checked hat for our trouble. <laughs> All right. Let us see what our percentage is. One hundred percent. We have completed the game. There you go. Hundred percent complete. I'm not doing any of that death wish shit. Forget that. Okay. 